Hello, I'm Stuart and today on Through the Tech Hole we'll be taking a look at the latest version of the Xbox 360 to reach British shores. Known as the Jasper chipset, Microsoft have utilised a 65 nanometer fabrication process in an attempt to cure the 360's biggest problem, that it has a tendency to cook its own guts. But is a reduction in die size the only internal change that's been made to the Xbox? Well, I'm going to take a look inside this very Jasper unit to see what Redmond have done in an attempt to cure the dreaded red ring of death. Okay, let's take a look inside. Carefully prized the top off. Now, one of the first things you'll notice is that the actual circuit board for the 360 now has a much smaller footprint than it did before. Um, also obvious things, we've got the warranty banana of course, uh, which slowly rots over time. Uh, basically it takes exactly one year from purchase to rot away and it's how Microsoft check to see if your 360 is still under warranty. Um, unexpected addition here, it appears to be one of uh, Microsoft's own brand wireless adapters, which is just hanging in there and not actually attached to anything. Uh, notice there's a message on it, ha ha, there was one in here all along, suck as. Hmm, well that could save you £60 if you're not scared of opening your machine up. Uh, what else have we got? Um, something in the corner here, it's a, a little pot, appears to contain some kind of semi-crystallised mucus. Um, not entirely sure what that's for, I haven't seen that on any schematic, so... Uh, We'll leave that and possibly send it to the lab later. But uh, as you can see from the inside there, really, you know, there's not going to be much overheating going on. They've still got the large fans at the back, but, you know, much smaller footprint should hopefully produce a lot less heat. Um, I don't know if there's anything under the DVD drive there. It's worth a look. We can get her off. There we go. And uh, what have we got? Oh yes, there's just a little sticker that uh, says Achievement Unlocked, looked under DVD drive. Hmm. So there we go, unless, ah no, we've got some more stuff under the lid actually. Uh, there's a green ladybird, presumably for good luck, and you'll notice of course a signed photograph of Peter Falk is attached. Uh, that was of course previously only included with the Elite models. So. Uh, you pays your money and takes your choice. As always, if you're planning to dismantle your 360 yourself, do make sure you've got the correct tools beforehand. Next time on Through the Tech Hole, we'll be dismantling a PlayStation 3. It's full of wasps!